A deadly dispute between neighbors in Brownsville. Police say three men were in an argument when one started shooting. CBS 4's Nestor Mazzo is in Brownsville with more on this tonight. Nestor. Marcy, I'm at the Brownsville Police Department where they've just released the names of everyone involved. Neighbors say they could hear the gunshots overnight. Children sleeping just feet away. Jadira Mato says she's been living near the 1700 block of West Elizabeth Street for over five years. It's so sad to see someone that lives so close to me has been murdered. She says she has never been more afraid to live there. I felt so scared, especially because I have kids. The mother of four small children woke up to gunshots at around one this morning. I heard three gunshots and I woke up to see the cops arrive. Brownsville police say it all began as a feud between neighbors. The bloodstains telling the story of what happened right outside Unit 8 early this morning. Investigators say 39-year-old Raul Canales shot 22-year-old Jesus Diaz and 24-year-old Steve Dorset after the fight. Diaz was shot in the foot and should be fine. Dorset was pronounced dead at the hospital. Canales was quickly arrested after the shooting and charged with one count of murder and another count of aggravated assault. Relatives on the scene say Canales lived right next door and that the two had never been in an altercation before. They didn't want to talk on camera, but say they hope Canales, quote, rots in prison. For shaking up neighbors, they're just glad he is in custody. I'm glad he was caught. If he could kill someone, who knows what else he may be capable of. Well, right now, investigators are trying to figure out what caused that fight to begin and escalate in the first place. In Brownsville, Nestor Mato, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.